Shalom Chavrim, I'm Stephen Ben Danoon, and I wanted to speak to you from my heart. As you guys know, as we've been reporting, in fact, here in just a small little bit of time here later this morning, in a couple of, actually a couple of hours, I'll be posting the interview that we had with Amy Shutreitz from uh, Haifa, Israel. We have other contacts in Israel as well, and we'll be doing more interviews, including Lori Cadoza Moore from uh, Proclaiming Justice to the Nations, uh, regarding the anti-Semitism that's, that is it's epidemic. Uh, Gulio Miati, I'm hoping we can get Gulio on also this week here. Uh, we have very serious stories that we are working on in the background uh, that will send shockwaves around the world. But in order for us to do what we are doing, we literally are, I've been in conversations today with the little small delivery business that we have, shutting things down there because we must work expeditiously with everything we do with haste and getting the message to you and to the world of what is happening to the Jewish people on a global scale. The things that are happening even here in America, there is news that has come out this morning that they have uh, smuggled terrorists, as I had been saying they were going to do, they've smuggled terrorists in uh, to the United States through the southern border. Uh, Zach Taylor, the retired uh, Border Patrol officer, has contacts with his men. You know, they have told them they're not getting ammunition until 2015. They have been told not to carry their rifles uh, anymore on the border. They have basically been limited to be able to not engage at all on the terrorists that are coming across. And of course, now they're to completely outgunned. So who, what can they do? Nothing. Um, there are stories that we will be bringing you that are shocking, very shocking to say the least. It will expose a lot of things that are going on and who's behind it. Um, but we desperately need your help to do this. Uh, I don't want to go into everything. I will say one thing. We have need of another camera that, like the one we're using now uh, for specific reasons. Uh, reasons I cannot disclose, but in the coming months, you will see. We are, we are intending to go where the battle is. We're intending to bring you coverage live from these battlefronts. And so there's a specific need that we have in that area as well, not to mention uh, to do the ministry full time, to give you the, the truth behind the scenes so that you can see. We are seeing Gulio Mianti. I, we, my wife published his report on Facebook this morning. In fact, we're, we're, we're even switching the Facebook account. We're going to a new Facebook page that is strictly for Israeli News Live so that you can see the events that are happening to where we're not having all the different comments from different ministries that have different takes on what's going on. We need to tell you exactly like it is. You guys know I love you, and it's very important to me to not sensationalize things, but to tell you exactly what's happening. It's because you need to know for your own safety and for you to be praying and for you to win your family to Christ and to do everything you possibly can. You know, even if it's a, if a Muslim that would be willing to listen about who Yeshua is, these things are urgent. This is the time because the Bible clearly says when the nations come against Israel, God will intervene himself. Now, unfortunately, we know from the scripture that there may be a, a huge death toll on the Jewish side once again before God intervenes. Just like it was in the time of Egypt, you know, God, the, 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 the Israeli people were under such a burden and all kinds of evils were happening before God finally sent Moses back. In fact, he left for 40 years. It was a time for being delivered 40 years before that. And in 1967, you know, Israel, in their battle, God victoriously gave them everything that they wanted. And then they turn around the political leaders who were not true Jews, surrender it all back over to the Muslim people because of the world pressure. Oh, so many things like that. But here's the thing. You guys are, you know, there are some alternative media that is telling you the truth, but not everybody is. And besides bringing the word of God, the unadulterated truth of the word of God, what really is, and, and we're doing this little tour through the United States again here in August, speaking in Houston, Texas, speaking in, and we don't go to any of these places asking for money. You know, 
In fact, in some cases, we know that there, there, it won't be. It just, it's just not there. But the thing is, is to reach more people to tell them the truth. That's our passion. That's the mission that we have, is to let people know what's truth. Not to go tickling the ears or, or give some fanciful tell about some, you know, cool biblical thing that really doesn't match the Word of God. They need to know what's truth. And we can't do this without you and without your support in this ministry to make it happen. And, and it's because of the love and support of those that have stepped forward and decided to support this ministry. And in some cases, people even saying, can we tithe to your ministry? It's, it's people like that that are helping us to, to, to give us the faith to say, we can do it, we can step forward. We're even moving from our house, looking for a place somewhere in the country that we can go uh, in order to cut our own expenses just so that we can bring the gospel to you. So we're making that sacrifice ourselves, but we desperately need your help. And I thank those that have helped already, but we, we need you in order for these things to happen. You will see very soon though, a very dramatic story. And then you'll understand why it's important that we get this information out. I'm Stephen Ben Danoon with Danoon Institute of Biblical Research. You can go to our website, israelreturns.com. You can uh, also, if you want to give by mail, you can mail it to us at 12537 Gemstone Court, Fort Myers, Florida, 33913. Uh, you can do the check to Danoon Institute. Uh, if you do it to Stephen Danoon, remember my real name is Stephen Ben Noon, B E N N U N. Uh, Danoon is what our name was before we restored it back to the original name. God bless you. We love you and thank you. Shalom.